So the Galaxy S24 Ultra is going to have a special frame made of a strong material called titanium. And despite it being denser than aluminum, the S24 Ultra will weigh less than its predecessor, showcasing remarkable engineering. Now, there are going to be other versions of the S24 called the regular S24 and S24 Plus. These ones won't have the super strong titanium because it costs a lot to use. But don't worry, they're still going to look a bit different. Notably, Reliable Leaker Ice Universe has disclosed that both the S24 and S24 Plus will sport flat frames instead of the slight external curvature seen on the S23. To clarify, the frames won't be entirely flat like those of the iPhone 14. Instead, it's a bit like how the newest Samsung foldable phones, the Z Fold 5 and Z Flip 5, look. Now, you might have seen iPhones that have those flat sides, and they look really cool and fancy. But sometimes those flat sides can feel a bit uncomfortable when you hold the phone for a long time. Samsung is trying to solve that problem with the S24 by making the edges a bit smoother so they don't dig into your hand. The regular S24 and S24 Plus will also have screens with really thin borders around them, which makes the phone look more modern and sleek. So when you put the flat sides and the slim borders together, these new phones are going to look awesome. Since the S24 Ultra has a curved display, it won't have the flat sides like the other models. While the latest foldable devices have just been unveiled, credible information about next year's Samsung foldables, the Galaxy Z Fold 6 and Z Flip 6 has already surfaced. In the case of the Z Flip 6, improvements are expected, particularly in the camera department. Galaxy Club, a reputable source, suggests a major camera enhancement with the inclusion of a 50 megapixel primary camera, a significant upgrade from the 12 megapixel main camera on the Flip 5. This is likely the same sensor used in the S23 and Plus models. As for the Z Fold 6, there are rumors that it might have a new form factor. A tipster said it could have a wider screen on the front, which is something a lot of people have been hoping for. But these are just guesses for now. We'll have to wait and see if they come true. Ice Universe also made a tweet that the camera hardware of the Z Fold 6 will remain unchanged, but he deleted the tweet for some reason. Like I've said, it's too early for the Z Fold 6 rumors, so we'll have to wait and see how these pan out. And that's pretty much it. If you have any more questions, feel free to ask, and I'll see you in the next video.